Good evening, everybody. This is my lot for Monday. So let's go over what I found. Did find a couple cool things. This is gonna sell for about 20 bucks. It's a brand new puzzle. I paid $1.50 for that. Next, we got these kind of rare Predosaurs toys, Aqua Attack. They were $2. I think I'm gonna get about 25 bucks for this. I'm gonna try for 30, but probably gonna get about 20 to 25. Even though these are a little rare, I didn't see very many up at all, and I didn't see many sold, so we'll see what happens. Next we got this Kobe RMS Titanic 1912, 450 piece. This is kind of like Legos. This is the first time I've ever picked up any Kobe stuff at a thrift shop, and I was worried that it might be open, but the it was open. But the bags inside are still sealed on this. And these go for about, I saw them selling for about 60 to $70 used. New, I'm not I'm not really sure I need to do a little more research, but brand new, there was some up for like $100, $120. Next we got this uh, Philly Fanatic pop figure. Now this is only the second pop figure I've ever found that's worth any money. And this is a kind of rare figure. They've been selling for a, in the $30 to $40 range, but the only ones up are, the cheapest one is $100. And I checked Amazon, there's only one on Amazon, and that one is also $100. And there's two on eBay for $140 each. So I figure I can probably get about 60 to 70 bucks on this pretty easily. And maybe more if I decide to wait. So yeah, for two bucks, that was a great score. Next we got this HO scale dual crossing gates by Bachman. And yeah, this is pretty straightforward. One dollar, and this is gonna go for about 20 to 30 bucks. That was a pretty cool find. Next, we got this cool box that I found. Let me fix the light real quick. All right, we got the light in a good position. Now I have not looked in this box. I actually pulled this out of a dumpster at the thrift shop. Now thrift shops actually have really cool stuff in their dumpster a lot of the time. Whenever you're at a thrift shop and they have a dumpster out there, take a look in the dumpster because what happens is the people who are going through this stuff, they get bored or tired sometimes and they're just like, oh, this isn't worth money and they just throw it in the garbage. I actually pulled out about $200 worth of laser discs one time um, and I found just a whole lot of cool stuff in thrift shop dumpsters. Anyways, this, I took one glance inside and I've actually been kicked out of there for going through their dumpster before at this one. So um, I haven't even really looked in this yet. I just noticed it's a bunch of toys and the only thing I saw when I glanced in was a pogo figure. Let's see what we got here. We got a box with a little plastic thing in it. And this appears to be worth nothing. Let's take a look here. What does that say? I cannot read that. Something original. I have no idea what that is. Unfortunately, I didn't have the lid. And we got, I can't remember what these guys are called either. Is there a bottom to this? Oh, there it is. I got a bottom to it. This is pretty cool. Oops. Let's see, come on. There it is with one hand. Cool. That's an interesting little item. Here's the pogo figure I saw. Let's see, are we gonna be able to focus camera? And what is the year on this? We're looking for a date. Ooh, 1969. This is a figure from 1969. That's awesome. And if you don't know what Pogo is, it's an old comic strip from the 60s. One of my favorite comic strips ever. If you've heard of Calvin and Hobbes, the guy who created Calvin and Hobbes actually was a huge fan of Pogo. And look at this. We got a whole woodsy owl, Veraview. Pin. That's cool. Woodsy Owl says, don't pollute. Alright, what else do we got here? Some felt homemade thing. 
Interesting. The last roundup. It's another pin. Frontier Village. Oh, that's from a mall around here. What is this? Oh, it's a pencil sharpener. It's an Arizona pencil sharpener with road runners and stuff on it. We have a ball. We have a bag. Is there anything in the bag? No, there's nothing in the bag. Oh well. We have a Christmas thing attached to a ball. <laughs> oh, this looks cool. Oh, it's a little wind-up robot. I love these little wind-up robots. What's the date on this? Oh, it's 1977 Tommy. Nice. Does he work? Come on, little robot. Oh, he's a little old. A lot of the time, these old robots just have died, but that's really cool. I love this old Tommy stuff. We have an old hairbrush with a little Hello Kitty. Oh, it's a Hello Kitty hairbrush. Oh, that's an old hairbrush. This is really cool. 1973, I think that is. 1973 Sanrio with a little tiny Hello Kitty. What year is that? Sanrio, Hong Kong. This is cool. All right. Awesome score. I'm really not sure how much that's worth, but it always has a possibility when it's since from the 70s. Got some old bracelets. Got a plastic thing. Got an old rubber, what is this? Some old rubber toy. D D diner? Oh, they made the old, those old dinosaurs. I think this is a UFO actually. This is really cool. That's really awesome. They made, made those old dinosaur erasers. Man, when thrift stores throw out stuff like this, it makes you wonder what in the world um, have they thrown out? I mean, they've got to have thrown out some amazing stuff. I bet this is even old. Little fuzzy thing here. Little fuzzy eyeball. Oh, we got another. Yeah, this is all like 70s and 80s stuff. This is really cool. This must be, oh, it's another uh, Hello Kitty, or not Hello Kitty, but Sanrio, who makes Hello Kitty. And this, what year is that? 1976, nice, that's awesome. And uh, that's probably from Hong Kong as well. Got an old ladder, I wonder what that's to. I'm gonna put that aside just in case I find the other part to it. We got another pin. Holy Childhood Association, share your love. Some metal thing. Is there a name on them? Oh, there we go. Aram Magic. I have no idea what that is, but they're both Aram Magic. Jerry Lewis Skatathon participant. That's cool. Got an old Fisher Price dog. Yeah, it's a wood one. That's broken though. Oh well. Old Super Ball. And a jack. And a an Ewok. That's an Ewok pin. Adam Joseph Industries. I think that's an Ewok, isn't it? I believe so. Let's see here. 1983, Lucasfilm. Yep, that's definitely an Ewok. An old doll hairbrush. This box is definitely a score. From the garbage, check your dumpsters at the thrift stores. I wonder if this is like the Lion King or something. It's for your hair. Some more bracelets. Oh, here's the top to that Sanrio thing. Little twin stars. Oh no, that's not the top, excuse me. It doesn't, it must be some sort of set though. Got a napkin. Little coin purse. Maybe. Let me check this coin purse. And there's nothing in the coin purse. Oh well. We got a little ring. Hand ring. 
another old doll hairbrush. Got an old eraser. A pen, Mr. Doodler by Drymark. Swizzler, got a shell, or sn snuzzle. Swizzler, just making up words now. Got an old cord here. All right, looks like we got a few more cool things in here too. Merry Christmas cookies. A magnet. It's a wooden cat thing. Tender Heart Treasures Limited, made in Taiwan. A fuzzy guy. What is he on? Oh, he's stuck to this. I think it's a little game. Sorry, buddy. I'm ripping you off. You're gross. It's a tiny little game. Oh, it doesn't have a name on it. Oh, it's a pencil sharpener game. Oh, you you have to try to get the balls in the in the holes. I'm gonna have to clean that up. And you are gross. Get out of here. You know, little chicken. I wonder what this little chicken goes to. Oh wait, here we go. Made in Hong Kong. Made in Hong Kong. Tiny little chicken. Pennsylvania, Amy, the Dutch country. Or Pennsylvania, the Dutch country, Amy. It's like an old license plate. I bet this is from the 70s or 80s. I wonder, it's supposed to be stick to something. Got a little homemade ashtray type thing. Health care, because we care. Kaiser Permanent, Permanente, 25 years. Got a little, looks like a doll dress, but I don't know. It, it's more like a cloth bell. It's kind of weird. A little perfume thing. Ralph Lauren, oh wow. Lorraine, it's Ralph Lauren. That's awesome. This might be old, I wonder if it's worth anything. There's some numbers, 20. Let me see here. 095 or I think it says 095. I could be wrong though. That's cool. Old Ralph Lauren perfume. My room. Another bracelet. This is the bottom to a cookie jar, is what it looks like. From 76. 1976 Sophie. And we got another ashtray. <clears throat> Little basket. We got a plastic cup with Santa Claus on it. Triplar. We got a top to something. I have not found the bottom to that yet. Got a little doll thing. Junior Police, Bart. Sof Sofel? What is that? Sofel Seals? Next, what's in here? A little da uh, horse. Magnet. Some tissue paper. Old plastic crystals. Those are cool. A little heart pendant attached to a. It's still got the tag on it. Oops. Burry Lou. Raining colors. 1987 Dakin and Company. Oh, that's cool. Is it? It's supposed to, oh, it's supposed to go like this. Okay, duh. It's a rainbow with a cloud that's raining colors. Get that in the light. That's awesome. Some old Dakin stuff's worth some cash, too. Another old Hello Kitty clip. Sanrio, 1976. Oh, this is awesome. 
That is spectacular. 70s and 80s is my years. I've got an old puzzle piece. Some ribbon. Got an old pin here. The bird on it. A kitty magnet. Another puzzle piece. Oh, this, that was an earring. That other, I thought it was a pendant, but that's actually an earring. I'm gonna have to find where I put that. Some felt, plastic thing. Some more bracelets. Here's another top. Oh, this is the bottom. Okay, this is the bottom to that Sanrio 1976. Here's the top. There we go. Cool. I think that's for soap or something. An old book uh, page thingy. <laughs> Here, kitty kitty. Herman, 1989. Cool. This is like a pretend lucky rabbit foot. It feels like fur. Yeah, this is like a pretend I hope it's pretend. I hope I'm not holding a, an actual rabbit foot. That almost feels like a real foot. That would be weird. If I'm holding a real foot right now, I don't think I am. A little plastic cup. Hong Kong. Another bracelet. And a pin. 1991 Rotary Oyster Festival. Oh, this is a miniature little paper doll. Oh, I think it's like Peter Rabbit or something. Yeah, you can see it's little rabbits. It's little rabbit paper dolls. Tiny little ones. Cool. And we got this wooden post thing. No idea what that is. And this is what was under it. Okay, now this smaller box was actually sitting inside a bigger box, so... Oh, wait. Let's see here. Another little crystal. Oh, wow, there's more stuff. Troll books. Troll books. And what is this? Oh, it's stickers. I think. Is this stickers? I don't know what this is. It is stickers. Yes, this is stickers. Interesting. Oh, here's the top to that box. Okay, cool. Maybe that box will end up being worth money. We got Songbird Dominoes. Oh, cool. Wow, this box is turning out to be awesome. <laughs> This is turning out to be fantastic. This definitely looks 70s or 80s. Copyright by National Wildlife Federation. This is awesome. More puzzles, puzzle pieces. I might have the whole puzzle in here, who knows. Storybook, have a storybook Christmas. Oh, more old stickers. Oh, this box, this is fantastic. This box is just great. More puzzle pieces. This is so cool. I love 70s and 80s stuff. I love everything, but 70s and 80s is my time. Even though I was only born in 1979. <laughs> I still like the stuff from the 70s. Okay, we got instructions for something here. Oh, this is instructions for a transformer. Oh, is there a transformer in here? Damn, I'm gonna go back there and see if they threw any more of this stuff out. They might have thrown a transformer out. Who is this? This is, yeah, this is definitely one of the 
G1 Heroic Autobot Perceptor. Perceptor? This is awesome. All right. Let's see here. Cats and Kittens Coloring Album. Wow. These old coloring books are great. Wow. Hopefully they didn't color in all these. What is this? The Art of Drawing Trees. Awesome. The Art of Seascape Painting. More awesomeness. Band Training. Band Today. Band Today. Is that, I think that might be a magazine, I'm not sure. Zodiac Stained Glass Coloring Book. Ah, oh, you guys colored it. Oh, no, they didn't. No, excuse me. I'm not really sure. This is, this is interesting. It's actually, like, kind of see-through. That's pretty cool. Exotic Birds Stained Glass Coloring Book. This one has a lot more of the pages. I think that the other one, actually, the pages got taken out. And butterfly stained glass coloring book. Wow, these are cool. What year are these? 1985. That's really cool. Can you believe they throw this stuff in the friggin' garbage? The Children's Book of Peoples of the World. Awesome. Karen Baldowski, the cat coloring book. Oh yeah, okay, this one's mostly, is mostly unused. Cool. Keep an eye out for unused coloring books if you want to resell them because they definitely can go for some money. Perk up sticker album. Oh, I got a bunch of old stickers. Oh, we got Ewoks. Yeah, we got all sorts of 80s and 70s stickers in here. Shirt tails. Catastrophe. I saw an Ewok back there. We got Hello Kitty. All sorts of stuff. Superman. That's really cool. Santa Clara County. Got some knitting thread, the little plastic knitting needle. Just say no to drugs, Lions Club. I have no idea what this is. Bridge to Juniors, Patch. Whoa, what is this? Etch a Sketch Action Pack. I didn't even know they made these. I wonder if it's in there still. Let's see if it's still in there. Yep, it's still in there. That's awesome. Got some more yarn, some felt, some puzzle pieces. And yeah, I, I didn't really point this out, but this is the border to that puzzle. I wonder what it is. No idea, but it's all busted up. Oh, hidden objects inlaid puzzle. It's an old worn puzzle. Oh, you know what this is? This must be. I've never picked one of these up before, but I think that this might be a um, like an old crochet, uh, a kid's crochet machine or something like that. And that's what that other piece must be. Or loom. Is it loom? I'm not sure exactly what what they are or anything about them actually but yeah Fisher Price I think that Fisher Price may have made an, a loom an old uh, toy loom that's really cool and oh my gosh you gotta be kidding me now I'm really gonna have to go back and look in that dumpster if they threw any more of this out this is a, from a rare a very rare transformer um oh man what's his name uh, Jet Jetfire I believe his name is Jetfire or something like that 
and this is one of his pieces. I found his uh, piece. Uh, he was famous for losing his pieces because he had a bunch of these red pieces. Oh my gosh! If they threw that guy out, oh, I'm definitely going back there tomorrow to see if I can uh, find him in there. <laughs> May just jump right in. Got an old patch. I think this is a uh, what is it? Uh, Boy Scout. I think this is Boy Scout. And some little doll pants. Puzzle piece. Doll shoe. Puzzle piece. Little flower water plant. Little hook. Jetfire. Jetfire was that Transformer's name. Puzzle pieces. A little Mother Mary. What does it say? Yeah, I can't read it. Oh, there we go. Rig. To the something to the for us. Yeah, I can't read it. Oh well. Got a ribbon. Got puzzle piece. Another little doll thing. And that's it. That is the entire box. I'm definitely going back to that um, that that dumpster tomorrow. And hopefully I'll find some transformers. Anyways, that's it for today. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. And uh, don't forget to subscribe. And I'm out of here. Adios. Peace.